Caramu House is hitting the big stage tonight. The theater, which is the oldest African-American theater in the nation, is back at Playhouse Square. This is a big thing. This is the first time Caramu has performed at Playhouse Square in 40 years. And today, it's presenting its Black Nativity production. Our crew got to check out a rehearsal for tonight's premiere, and Tanisha Gradell has more from behind the scenes. Yes, so much excitement. This Caramu crew has been rehearsing for a little over six weeks now, and it's still an ongoing process, but they're navigating strict pro, uh, COVID protocols. They're testing twice a week, but they're so excited. Like I said, honored and ready to go. Lights. Camera. Action. I'm a part of history. Caramu House is back at its sister theater, Playhouse Square. It's about community connecting uh, and cultural arts organizations coming together to uh, celebrate. And a full circle moment for the historic theater and its cast that we caught during rehearsal. When I was younger, I used to come and see performances here all the time. Lion King, you know, Chicago, other Broadway shows. And I always thought that it would be me up there one day. So just to be able to perform on the same stage as other big name shows is a blessing. Now the moment is here. My grandparents are coming on the first night, then my mom is coming this, the rest of the weekend. Family, friends, I'm just, I'm super excited to be here. With 12 vocalists and six dancers, the special home team is presenting Black Nativity. We have a, a history of doing the production off-site. So returning to Playhouse Square in almost 40 years is just a gift. Originally written by Langston Hughes, the production retells the poet's faith-filled nativity story performed by an all-black cast, as we're told, and witnessed behind the scenes, this hand clap, toe clap, soul-stirring celebration is one you will not want to miss. You're going to hear new arrangements of old gospels and spirituals, and you're going to see the community coming together as a whole to celebrate the holiday season. For me, it always just brings a sense of joy. Um, so I hope people leave with that. You know, I hope people cry, I hope people smile, I hope people just enjoy themselves overall. <laughs>I love that ending. The, it, it's, just, it's just there, right? The Caramu team is certain this will be an exciting run at Playhouse Square. You can catch Black Nativity there until December 18th. Uh, do you feel it? I, I feel I, it? I, I'm going to see it next week. Yeah. I'm actually I'm, I'm going next week to That's see awesome. it. Now, I was, ran into Tony Friday mm -hmm. night. I was there for the Hip Hop Nutcracker last Friday. And he is like overjoyed. They were transporting all the stuff from Caramu oh, to yeah. Playhouse Square and said, man, you could see it all over him. Like, this is such a great thing. Yeah. For and they've taken good. time. They've, you know, yeah. literally put so much time in the detail. I mean, they've redesigned the lighting, yeah, the, the sound, set everything. and the costumes looked amazing. Oh, yeah. And what's oh. the move, Tanisha? It's the, you know, uh, I love it. I love it. I'm just yeah. going to let you two. Yeah, there you go. Uh, you want to see me dancing. How we're ending right. the show? There we go. You should do it, Mike. <laughs>